All right, come on in, close the door, and lock it. Now! Okay. All right, sweetie. Closing the door. Close the door! Lock it. I'm unarmed. You got my gun there? Yeah, I do, don't I? Star, you all right? Hey, Zach, you know, why don't we lose the gag? She doesn't need that. You don't like how I'm treating your daughter, Manny? Okay, okay. You're calling the shots, Zach. For sure. No one's gonna make a move without your say-so. But, would you mind taking your hands off of her? Oh, what's wrong? You're not having fun yet? Why don't you just let her go? <laughs> I saw pictures of this place in the paper. You and Marty's getaway. <laughs> Real romantic. Todd's big do-over. You let her go. You and I will settle this. Great, Manny. Now there's two hostages instead of one. Mom, how can you ask me to leave? Star is upstairs with a creep holding a gun to her. The same creep. Mom, you don't understand. I love her. I know you do, but it's not safe in this house. Mom, I'm not leaving. Okay, then I'm not leaving either. You just let her go, and we'll settle this, you and me. Oh, no, we, we can't do this without her, Todd. We're having a nostalgic moment here. You know, you, me, locked in an upstairs bedroom with an innocent young girl here. We all know what happens next. And what the hell is that supposed to mean? Do I have to spell it out? I think you're gonna rape my daughter. What the hell is going on up there? We have to let John handle this. What happened? What do you mean? He told me you love Star. Yes, well, I tried to hate her. For lying, for her dad, for, for helping him get away with everything. He did to you what he was going to do with our baby. But it, it doesn't matter. I mean, it, 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 nothing changed. Not really. Uh, yeah, but when you really love someone, they're always a part of you. I think Star would agree with you. What do you mean? It doesn't matter. Star just needs to come down from that room. See that? See how she looks at you? Because she knows when you're in the room that daddy's in charge. Just let her go. He was always like that. <laughs> the ringleader. It's his idea to rape Marty. Did she tell you that? He got us to do it. And back then, I was stupid enough to go along with him. But no more, man. Jack, you don't want to go to prison, do you? There's a way out of this. Just let her go. I don't think so, Manny. This time, we're gonna do it my way. What are you talking about, Zach? This is all of you. You said you wanted money. I'm giving you money. You wanted a way out of here. I'm giving you that. I agree to all your terms. But you cannot expect to hurt my daughter and get a fresh start. I don't want to hurt her. I want to hurt you, Todd. I'm just going to use her to do it. This is crazy. This, this, this. Oh, I have, I have to no, go there. I have to go with me. Hey, talk to me. Talk to me. What were you and Star doing here anyway? We weren't here together. I, I, I got here first. I, I came here to talk to Manny. Why? Not, not about you. I, I, I probably, probably shouldn't have been here at all. But if I hadn't, who knows what that guy would have done to her? Are you okay? How, how can I be okay? That whack job has Star locked up in that room. Okay, okay, try and calm down. Did you hear something? Somebody's coming. Hey, go, go. I'm not going anywhere without you, John. John. Yeah. Oh my God. Is Star okay? Yeah. Look, uh, Rosen's got her locked in. Manning's in with them. Let's call the police. No, no, Rosa said no cops. Yeah, I think Cole's right. All right, we don't want to set this guy off. Okay, can you, can you hear what's going on? No. Well, look, if we're going to get them out of there, I need your help. <laughs> you think you can use Star to hurt me? She's your daughter. <laughs> I don't know. 
<laughs> According to her mother, she is. I played along for a while, you know, but she turned on me. What's that phrase? Uh, an ungrateful child is sharper than a serpent's tooth. Yeah, that's it. Is that you, honey? Did you sting your daddy? Huh? Yeah, she stung me right where it counts. The wallet? Yeah. And a little further north, too. She's someone else's daughter now. You probably didn't hear it, did you, Jack? Larry remarried. Guy named John McBain. Yeah, I, I, I read the wife remarried. Yeah. Little old star here. She made her choice. So, you know how I feel about betrayal, right? Do you know? Zero tolerance. So. <laughs> Don't you move the time. Why not? I mean, I, I'm just telling you. I don't care about the kid. Do what you will. But you might as well let her go, and you and I can settle this once and for all. Just let her go, and we can settle this. <laughs> yeah, like you'd care. Oh, boy, you two should really take this on the road. I'm just trying to give you what you want, Zach, what you really want. Relax, Todd. I'm not gonna rape your daughter. Well, that's a wise move. Just let her go. We'll make a deal. You know what? I've, I've got a better idea. Since you don't give a damn about her, why don't I just kill her? <laughs> There's another way into the bedroom other than the door in the hall. Other than the window? Hey. You okay? You with us? Yeah. All right. There's a forced air vent in the hallway that I noticed. I'm, I'm wondering, do you know if there's a, a duct that connects it to that room? I have no idea. But, but Todd had a blueprint drawn up last fall. He wanted the house in New Mexico to look like this one. But Where? I, you could catch them both in here somewhere. Here, these? Yes. And screw it up. Oh, I don't think he'd do anything to hurt. I got it. John, I'll come in with you. No, listen to me. Stay here. Protect your mom, all right? If I'm not back down in 15 minutes, you call the station. You ask for Officer Saeed. She'll know what to do. Can you handle that? Yeah. Hey, good man. Be careful. Well. John won't let anything happen to Star. What's that? It's. Stars. It must have come off her neck when Zach grabbed her. She keeps a lock of our baby's hair in it. She wears it all the time. She's gonna be okay. I forget, you know, that she has her own stuff. I got so mad at her. Why? That's why I came here to uh, tell her dad about this guy that she's hung up on. Cool. I'm sorry, I didn't. I didn't realize Star had somebody else. Uh, he, uh, he was her teacher. His name is Skylar Joplin. He's like 10 years older than she is. Wait a minute, it's Joplin, isn't, wasn't he your drug counselor at the center? I mean, is that why you wanted to get rid of him? Yeah. He, he claims that there's nothing going on between them. But I went to go see him today after I left you. And uh, I saw Star leaving his place. And, th and that's what you wanted to tell Todd? Yeah, his daughter is in way over her head. But he wasn't here. No, he was here, and I told him what happened. And then he took off. Took off your Joplin? No. I probably shouldn't have told him what happened. But I didn't know what else to do. Or maybe I just wanted him to kill the guy.